happy to be here. <laughs> you don't get. So, what does one wear to Dante's Inferno anyway? Vito, I know you're listening. I love you. <laughs> I'm on my way to the biggest party of the year. I just got over a hunk. Now I'm into geeks. I'm after that guy. Hi, uh, we're the band. I'm Donnie. This is Marie. Hi. Hi there. Do I look okay? I think my skirt's a little bit too short. <laughs> you know, blondes always do have more fun. It's none of your business. Get out of my face. Hey, what's up? Things you'll do for pain. <laughs> We're here. Should have came alone. Well, the night can only get better. Everybody at home, this party's gonna reel. I'm going to Disney World! I'm really hoping to meet John Casavetti's here. Can't wait to get smashed with you guys. Got the dome. There's the party. Hey, baby, sorry to crash your party. Hey, single men, are you ready? Hi, I'm about to feel real good. Somebody told me Elvis was here. Hey, you are Elvis. Where's my hair? No. Where are the girls? Spontaneity is highly overrated. Hey, I hear Vito is twisted. Congratulations, you have survived mode. Good luck in the real world. Welcome back. We are approaching the final phase of the mode event. Do you know where your priorities are? We are in the last phases of the mode event. What mode are you in? This concludes mode. You have experienced a modality shift. Quite possibly, nothing will ever be the same again. Mode is now over. Mode is just beginning. Mode is forever. Mode is a state of mind. Brevis has steadfastly refused all requests for an interview, but has magnanimously allowed our camera to record his performance, which if previous years are any indication, could very well prove to be the biggest surprise in an evening full of surprises. Let's watch. Shocking news just in that the bodies of two men have been found on the street outside, apparently having fallen for reasons unknown from the roof adjacent to this party. Police have not yet released any positive identification, but presumably they were guests at this very event. We'll have more information as it becomes available. It's uncertain at this time whether host Vito Brevis has been made aware of this tragic development. But aware or not, he is about to take the stage for his grand finale. Shocking news just in that the body of a man has been found on the street outside, apparently a suicide from the roof adjacent to this party. Police have not yet released any positive identification, but presumably he was a guest at this very event. We'll give you more information as it becomes available. It's uncertain at this point whether host Vito Brevis has been made aware of the tragic development, but aware or not, he is about to take the stage for his final performance. The question on everyone's mind tonight is what will Vito do for an encore? For weeks now, he has been hinting in the press that this might be his last multimedia appearance, indeed perhaps his last public appearance of any kind, and that he plans to go out with a bang. Well, whatever happens, I'll be your eyes and ears on the scene. This is Charity Flame for Nightlight Magazine. Rolling. <laughs> Rolling. <laughs> Astonishing. Amazing. Awesome. Words cannot possibly do justice to the feelings at work in this room at this moment. What have we just experienced here? 
I think I can speak for everyone in this room, witnesses to this transformation, that this was no simple magic trick, no prop and lighting illusion. There is no doubt in my mind that whatever Vito has done, whoever, whatever he is involved with, it is certainly something momentous. Is he really gone? Can we really ever know? Will things ever be the same again? This is Charity Flame reporting to you from the mode event. And the only negative note on the evening so far, the collapse of stand-up comic Rudy Zuckerman, better known by his stage name Killer Clown, discovered comatose at a stage side table just moments ago. Zuckerman was the apparent victim of a drug overdose and was rushed to hospital by hotel security. Our thoughts go with him. And now we are just moments away from the final performance by host Vito Brevis and enjoying the age-old pastime of mingling with the young, the beautiful, and the creatively endowed. And so far, Vito has not let us down. The scene here tonight has been what I'm going to call chic and freak. Local art fans will remember last year's apocalypsing karaoke catastrophe at the Hideyoshi Tower with its shocking animal acts and giant inflatable body parts. While this year Vito has toned down the shock, toned up the shtick, mixed in a black and neon cabaret decor and set the whole thing against the backdrop of high-tech haute couture. What a letdown. The anticipation for the grand finale has been electrifying. Vito's announcement of a change in plans, whether genuine or part of some larger scheme on his part, has had a dramatic effect on everyone here tonight. People are wasting no time heading to the elevators. It's coat check time. A strange turn of events to cap an evening most notable for its strangeness. This is Charity Flame on the scene at the Mode event. Welcome to Mode, an interactive installation of fashion and art diversion by Vito Gross. Your pass to this event is the dome pin you received with your ticket. You must wear this at all times while inside the mode event. Failure to wear the dome will result in ejection from the event. There are no other rules. Mode. Noun. Manner, way, or method of doing or acting. A particular form, variety, or manner. Current or customary fashion or style. A particular form or manner in which an underlying substance is manifested. Any of numerous patterns of wave motion. What mode are you in? There are many modes of being. There are many modes of thought. There are many modes of action. Choose carefully. Mmm. Oh. De. Uh. Going so soon? Goodbye.